Hello, hello everybody, and I have a very special kind of shrimp unboxing here today. While I was out of town for work this week, my wife said, look what just arrived. And it's been, it would have been exactly 20 days ago that I'd shipped these shrimp out. And due to an address mishap, they ended up being tossed around in the mail and sent, ba sent back to sender as an inf insufficient address. Here you can see it was shipped November 25th. Got held up in New Hampshire and sat there. And then yesterday, December 15th, arrived back to my house. I was at, at work out of town in a hotel room. My wife video chats me and says, look at this package. It showed up. It arrived. And as she opens it up on video camera, she pulls out the shrimp. And here we go. Opens the box and look at that movement. We have live shrimp 20 days in the mail, December or November 25th to December 15th. Live shrimp. Look at that. I don't even see any dead ones. To be fair, some may have died and became lunch and that's how the other ones lived but and then with it being just my wife and i'm not home and out of town i said the guppy pond is just a catch-all for where i don't want it anymore pretty much and i get to enjoy it so i said just toss them in there so now they're, sh they're part of the shrimp population in the guppy pond <laughs> so that was pretty awesome shrimp are tough and if shipped right, they can do good and survive a long time. Survival is not really a question. And these are bouncing around Indiana, New Hampshire. And during December, that's a long time. And that can be, I mean, 20 days, Indiana, New Hampshire, November to December. Those are some cold temps. These guys survived. And... They got made it back. First time this has happened. It was an interesting experience and surprised me that they are still good, especially after being cellophane. So thank you guys for watching. Bye.